TK Tower video brings you... Digimon 2016! I am so tired right now, it's it's unreasonable. Like, I'm... I picked up this game today, went to the mall, picked it up, and I was on the bus home. I'm like, man, I am so tired, I almost want to just do this another day. That's how tired I am. I'm so tired that I questioned my own loyalty and excitement for this fucking game. But here I am. Doing it. I'm not putting it off. Oh, 15th anniversary. That means Digimon Dry. Okay, I got, a uh, picked up some booze. Got, oh, dropping some booze now, too. Got myself a Rev because it's, uh, it's like an energy alcohol drink. And I need the energy, let me tell you. Fucking Digimon Cybersuit, here it is. This is, uh, I've been waiting a long time for this. I feel like a lot of, a lot of Digimon fans were. We, we got Digimon All-Star Rumble a while back. That's, uh, well, I mean, thanks for trying, I guess. But this is what we wanted. We wanted the game that came out in Japan that people said was good, got reviewed well, and now here it is. It's on uh, your PlayStation 4 and your Vita. I, of course, am playing on my PlayStation 4. Change options, yeah. All right, we want this, we want a mini-map. Show that, battle cutscenes, normal, I guess. Okay, a normal, I guess. Uh, yeah, begin with these settings. Oh yeah, of, of course we gotta have a, of course we gotta have a nifty CG opening. It wouldn't be a Digimon game without one. I don't know what's happening right now. This is this is very unlike Digimon that I'm familiar with. Because like uh, when this game came out in Japan. You'd think as a Digimon fan, it would be like, oh man, like look into it, research this shit. But I'm like, you know what? If it's coming to the States, I want it to be special. I want it to be a surprise. I don't want to spoil anything. And if it's not, then I don't want to tease myself with details. So this is it. I know so little about this game. I know it exists. I've seen like a brief um, English trailer. I know that I think it borrows some mechanics from the DS games, but we're gonna learn all about that. So this looks like it's trying to mimic some kind of social media chat room sort of thing. You're talking about Digimon programs, right? Those dangerous programs used by hackers? Dangerous? How dangerous exactly? They can break through security, steal data? Enter password protected forms with ease? Those programs can do all kinds of nasty things. They're behind most of the incidents that have been happening. Wow, Digimon sound nuts. My friend got his account targeted by them. No way. When did this happen? In some areas, Digimon roam around on their own. Wait a minute. Digimon can move? Sounds like these programs have avatars, kind of like monsters. Digimon, like digital monsters? Exactly. When did this happen exactly? Oh, Mr. Navid is logged in. What is going on with this game? This uh, this is more like Summer Wars than Digimon. Mind you, Summer Wars is essentially the Digimon movie again, but not Digimon. Yo, what's up, people? What? It's Mr. Navid, huh? You mean the Eden mascot? Sorry, man. No solicitations, haha. Uh -huh. What the heck? Why would an Eden official come all the way out here? This was a private room, you know. Just who are you? And what's with that greeting? Hardly suiting an official. Wait a minute. Is he a hacker? Speak of the devil. For real? That's right. I'm Mr. Nabbit, the hacker. I have a fantastic present for all of you. Be sure to log into Eden tomorrow. Don't forget now. If you don't log in, I'll hack you. Bye-bye now. <laughs> He's logged out. He seems like a nice guy. What the heck? Was that an actual hacker? No way, dude. Think someone's playing a prank on us. 
Sounds fun, don't it? Let's check it out. That uh, that name, Akino, that seems a lot like Akiho from uh, Redigitize. I wonder if that is her, and that's just like her English name. What? Don't tell me y'all are chicken. You want to go, Akino? What do you do if it's a real hacker? This is just PR for Eden event, ain't it? A real hacker would be cooler, though. Sounds like I can't stop you. Fine, then. I'll come with. What, is this a date now? You asking me out all of a sudden? Anyway. One called Dark Knight Satan. <laughs> what a strange name. Anyone else gonna come with us? Better safe than sorry, I'm out. Yeah, I'll pass. Me too. I'm in. So I, I believe some characters from the redigitize and uh, redigitize decode might be coming to this game, which will be a bit uh, strange for people that did not play. Well, of course the game's Japanese. It's, it wasn't released here at all. But uh, I did. There is an English patch, which I did stream. So I won't be completely ignorant to some of these new characters. I'll talk about them when we get to them, if we get to them. Like I said, I, I know very little. I can only confirm as we go. I can know when Blue Box went on with their late night gab fest. As always, topics were loose with no real focus. Eventually, dawn broke outside their windows. That was the day they were finally going to meet in Eden. They spent the day much as they did the day before. And then, the appointed time drew near. Oh, is this player input here? Alright. Uh... I mean, I am male, but it really comes down to which costume I like better. I like, uh... Man, uh, both, like, obviously these designs are pretty similar, like, with inverted colors, but I like both these designs quite a bit. Oh, I'm a sucker for pigtails. And I like that... But this one has more black than yellow, and I'm more leaning towards more black, and he's a pretty cool-looking dude. Hmm... Man, this is tough. I like both these character designs. You know what? I'm I'm a sucker for pigtails and skirts. So I guess uh, I guess I will be playing the role of a female in this game. Of course, I'm gonna enter a name. Oh, TK Tao, of course. Oh, look, it knows. Like I haven't input that text a number of times already. Oh, I'm TK Tao. The a, f a female persona of her, I suppose. Log in with the inner data. Yeah. Got some rev here I'm drinking in between reading. So we didn't get uh, quite the CG opening I was expecting, although it looks a bit like we are now. Welcome to the Digital Garden of Eden. Wow, we didn't even get English voice actors. Eden is a virtual world, metaverse, providing several revolutionary services in a new generation of digital content. Bountiful entertainment including shopping and movies, everything from corporate transactions to political administration. Everyone's needs are met. I will be more than happy to introduce some of the available services that will be part of your daily life. The future of the net is not behind a screen. It is intuitive virtual reality through the use of avatars. Yeah, this is just, this is Summer Wars. I do hope you enjoy using our cutting-edge cyberspace services. Eden is a human network connecting the world to the future, run by Kamishiro Enterprises. Oh look, it's me. I'm pretty cute. I was expecting some English voice acting at least. I guess, uh, no, let's just run the text through a translator. That's enough. Oh, that looks cool. They're not using images. They're using 3D models for editors. I like that. The entrance to Eden. This is where we promised to meet. Although, uh, as, as uh, if you've seen some of my redigitized streams, I do try to change my voice a bit when I'm reading out other characters' dialogue. Although I'm playing as a chick, I will be using my own voice. So I'm sorry. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna squeeze my balls over trying to get my pitch up here. I'm here a little earlier than we'd agreed on. I'm guessing Akino and Blue Box still aren't here. I like the uh, the red cell shading. That that seems uh that was a thing in the movie in the Digimon movie when when they were in uh, the internet, which I guess resembled this a bit. 
but uh, generally if the background is mostly white or your character is mostly black, I've noticed that more recent animes will go for a, a red outline and then switch to black when uh, it contrasts a little better. <clears throat> Anyways, this will be the first time I've met them outside a chat room. I don't know what their avatars look like though, but I should be able to figure it out. I'll try making small talk with the even avatars in the area. Oh boy, it's small talk time. Okay, I can zoom in and out. I cannot turn the view left or right. I'm logged in from abroad. It's all thanks to Eden that I can keep up with my buddies. I'm glad for you. Buddies are important. Look here. Oh, look there. No, don't be obvious. It's a hacker. You shouldn't get too close. Sorry, this little girl. I got a cell phone digivice for my birthday. Yours are those goggles? They're pretty sweet. Next time I'll pick some up. Wait, so digivices look like other things? She has one that's a cell phone, mine are goggles? Maybe that'll be more expanded on. Digivice is logging to Eden, and the voice features are handy. Still, maybe my daughter's too young for one. I'm worried about security. Yeah, you're right to. Smart to uh, chaperone your kid in a chat room online. Talk to this. Oh, what's this? Uh, Alright, let's experiment. Go no, I don't want to go into another area. Did I talk to this guy? That round thing with the arrow is the access point. You can use it to travel around Eden. Huh? What? <laughs> That's really all he has to say. I've heard there's an area in Eden filled with hackers. Why wouldn't the company shut such a dangerous place down at once? It's Creepy Hacker. Oh, his name is Creepy Hacker. Guys, I'm gonna take a shot in the dark and say this guy's a hacker. What's this? Oh, it's just, it looks like it's just a lamp. I see other ones there. This entrance is one of the largest in all of Eden. There's even a pavilion further in. Have you heard of pavilions? Pavilions are places where companies can safely and securely do business over Eden. Unfortunately, they aren't open to the public. For any errands at the bank or the post office, the forms can all be taken care of here in Eden. This really is a world of convenience. Yeah, it sounds like it. Today I'm logging in from a top class salon in R Rapangi. Sure, both the service and the avatar management are first rate. I've been to Shinjuku and Shibuya's Eden spots, but the login areas and cafes were packed and what's more, filthy. I deserve better. Oh shoot, I'm not supposed to be at this pavilion today. I messed up the URL again. You can use access points to get to areas with connections that are always live, but to go anyplace else you'll need the URL. Heard a rumor. There's a ghost going around Eden. If you ask around, you'll, you'll, you'll hear stories about the white boy. <laughs> or just Baka Gaijin. But if you look real close, the facial texture is all messed up. The arms and legs are slimy tentacles. Its, it's real form is the Demon of the Creeping Darkness. It comes up to your avatar and snaps it up. Chomp chomp. That sounds like Nyarlathotep though. Friggin' Eldritch Horror. Wandering Chaos Fuel. That's the rumor anyway. You know, Digimon has actually touched on Lovecraft. Uh, in Season 2, they go to a place they can they call the Dark Ocean, and I think uh, at the end it shows Cthulhu in the background. It gets weird for a little bit. Nowadays, being able to work at a company's Eden branch is a huge status symbol. Alright, so yeah, this, this is Summer Wars. Everything is done in this virtual world. Even though I'm in the digital world, my avatar looks just like the real me. I know it's supposed to cut down on crime, but it still sucks. Oh, that, that glowy thing. It wants me to do the thing, but I need to talk to a purple suit. Looking for your friend? If they're not here, did you try looking in the community area? It's an open area, just like the entrance, so you can get there from any terminal. Oh. Alright. Oh, there don't seem to be any avatars like them. I guess I showed up too early after all. Hmm. Uh, it's, it's a little jarring when uh, just now, when uh, the screen froze to bring this up, all the, the red outline disappeared around my character, like in the background there. That's fine though. A minor, a minor thing. There's still time left before our meeting. I should check out some other areas. 
Watch, it's gonna. Oh no, it's not gonna pop back in. Okay. Oh, yeah, I wasn't. I wasn't done looking around. I was just talking to this dude. I'm going to that. Like that glowy is obviously progression. Unless it wants me to take the portal, I gotta talk to all these NPCs. I think Eden avatars move faster than real people. <laughs> is that how you feel, kid? Hey, now keep running like that, and you're going to fall. Even as an avatar, it'll still hurt. Oh, is that a thing? That's that's awful. Ah, it's fine. It's it's well, it's no more running than Jim. Just an avatar, so it won't affect his muscles, but it will be good image training, no? Where is she? I was supposed to meet my friend ages ago, but I don't see her anywhere. <laughs> is it this girl? My friend's late. I wonder if there's a problem with her access point. The public ones are better, but expensive, so she usually logs in from home. <laughs> I hope they're not looking for each other. Oh god, there's been a server-side error where some players are not appearing to other players. Alright, let's go to the glowy. I'll give in. Got Gummymon Metal. Right. Okay, I guess that's locked. That's a, a pavilion, I suppose. Let's move on. I guess it uh, seems like I've spoken to everyone in this area. Let's move to another area. Wow, I fucking zipped right off. Oh, tutorial moving to Eden. Use the directional buttons to choose a destination. If there are new areas that you can go to, they will be indicated with new. Selecting log out from the options on the left will return you to the point you use to access Eden. Alright. You can go to Eden Community Area now. Alright, so I guess I was just at Eden Entrance, so hold on, I'm gonna take a little sippy. Alright, we're going to this new area. Game's proceeding a little slow, and uh, I mean, probably not to you guys. I don't play a lot of RPGs. I only make the exception for Digimon, but uh, I suppose, you know, there's there's a lot of lore and stuff to learn, so I'm gonna I'll take, as, I'll take as long as it needs. This is the community area. I like this place. It's quiet and relaxed. Oh, oh god. My Digivice's talk feature is getting a call. Who could it be? Oh, she seems really worried. Huh? Oh, it's Eden, the thing. Hey there, it's me, Mr. Nabbit. Right, Mr. Nabbit, that was his name. Just one sec. Uh, you're behind schedule, silly. You're gonna be late. Hurry up. Come to Galacta Park in Kowloon. Your two friends arrived a little while ago and are waiting for you. I have a gift for you all, but everyone has to be there first. Bye bye Kowloon, isn't that the dangerous area full of hackers? Uh... Hmm. Okay, calm down. No need to panic. Yeah, put a smile on. I wonder what he meant by a gift. Anyways, anyway, let's go to Galacta Park in Kowloon. Hmm. Hmm. I've never been anywhere near Kowloon. How do I get there? Hmm. 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 There might be somewhere. There might be someone here who knows how to get to Galacta Park in Kowloon. I better ask around. Uh, I got the keyword Galacta Park Kowloon. Keyword is that? Does that like uh, okay? During conversation, you will hear keywords. Keywords you hear will be marked with a lock icon. This means that you can ask a character about that keyword. If you ask about the right keywords, the lock will open and you will learn some new information. Okay, cool. All right, it's it's good to know who you should and shouldn't bother talking to. I mean, I'm gonna talk to everyone anyways. I found a sparkly thing at the end of the street, and then I saw something awesome. Was it a gummy mon thing? Still can't turn the camera. That monument's a miniature of Eden. Okay, I hope this is a thing. Give it to me. I got Oopamon metal. Is that the latest Digivice? Sweet! If I had one, I could do so much. So the term Digivice stands for a digital D what? Digital D Jur standard terminal? My buddy's cousin's friend said so. Is that I don't understand that. What's Jur? 
De jure? Oh, wow. All right. The area, the top area is for the Eden offices of government agencies and big corporations. It's so glitzy. And then the bottom level, it's filled with old trash data. They say it's pretty seedy. I've heard that the virus attacks all originate down there. It's a real public nuisance. Minomon medals. Alright, I don't know what these do yet. This this girl cannot be spoken to. She's not having it. I thought I'd meet with my friend to go shopping, but there's so many shops here needing. Just one is enough. I may be too old to get far in the real world, but here in Eden, my avatar can go for miles. It's real nice. I'm glad for you, old man. This person doesn't want to... This person has nothing to say to me. Alright, well, you're the last one, buddy, and I see you have the, uh, the icon. Kind of busy here. Oh, okay. So it just brings up a little list here. Okay. Tell me about Galactic Park, Kowloon. What? You want to go to Kowloon? But why? It's lawless and filled with hackers. Besides... If that's what you're into, we're done here. Go talk to a hacker if you want to know about it. There's a hacker looking thug near the entrance. Don't blame me for your foolish decisions. Grow up and take responsibility for yourself. Wow, okay, dickhead. Just asking. He must have meant the entrance of the game. That, uh, that one that was named, like, Creepy Hacker. What's what? Alright, I'm back. Yeah, of course it's... Oh, there's another one over there. Well, I feel like this person's the least creepy, so let's uh, let's talk to her. What now? What can you tell me about Galactic Park, Kowloon? Kowloon Cracker Parts? What, what's that supposed to be? It sounds awful. Oh, you meant Kowloon Galactic Park. I don't know that one either. Sorry, maybe you should ask someone else. Okay, so she's not useful. <laughs> At least from here, I can see, like, all the NPCs. Right. Oh, this one too. I guess not all of them. They don't get an X prompt, they just have that. Huh? What? Oh, what do you know? None. I heard of Kowloon before, but not no Galacta Park. But it's just a park made of Galactas, right? Haha. <laughs> so you're saying you want to go to Kowloon, for real? Then you better get a URL from somewhere. Duh, everyone knows that. Ha ha ha. Alright, weird dude. Looks like you. Creepy hacker. Nothing to say, huh? Hmm. I want to go to Galactic Park in Kowloon. That's what you think you want, isn't it? I'll show you the way. This is the URL to their area. Take it. Got the URL. Now I can go to Kowloon. I assumed he made that noise. I can't confirm. Alright, now I'm gonna go to Kowloon, right? Should be able to select it from here now that I have the URL. You can now go to Kowloon level 1. Alright, here we go. Oh, when are we gonna get to fighting, man? I wanna see them battles. Actually, after this cutscene, I'm gonna check my uh, share button options to see if I, I want to set it so if I just tap uh, tap the button I can grab screenshots because I'd like a couple so we're getting this, uh, some more cool CG I know uh, this is uh, another time I've mentioned the general CG openings but uh, generally the Digimon games and uh, if you haven't seen them you can uh, check out the previous Digimon as well as this one where did everyone go? huh? Actually, no, because there's Japanese voice acting here, I'm not going to read it out loud. And that, I think that is Akiho. Or Akino, she's going by now. But anyways, yeah, generally the CG, there's just, it just shows a bunch of Digimon fighting. It's not at all plot related, and then it's over. I'm hoping for something like that real soon. Would you happen to be Akino by any chance? Oh, hey, yep, I'm at, oh, there's voice acting here, okay. I mean, I'll, I'll read this anyway because that's Japanese. Oh, yep, I'm Akino. This is your first time in Eden, right? My real name's Nokia Shiramine. Hello. Nice to meet you. 
<laughs> oh, wow, there. Not. Huh? You're late. What were you doing? Leave me all alone in such a dangerous place. How would you feel if you were in my shoes? You're asking if Blue Box has shown up yet? Oh, he showed up alright. But what does that even matter? Like, can you believe this? He's all, oh, I've got to go and find a ghost, and all of a sudden he's running off by himself. That's how he rolls, apparently. 100% full of himself. Thinks he's all that just because he's got good looks or whatever. And, and so like, what? The ghost of the pale boy? I've heard the rumors, but don't know the details. What does he even plan to do if he finds it? I mean, ghosts in cyberspace? That's unscientific. It doesn't even make any sense. Not that I'm scared or nothing. Boo. Eek! Whoa, easy. Overreacting a bit there, aren't we? Oh, <laughs> he just transitions his foot off. Oh, jeez, Arata, it's just you. I, I thought you were a ghost. Sheesh. You don't have to act all tough by coming to a place like this if you're chicken, you know. Hey now, you're the one who ditched me in that place like this, Arata, you slimy little no-good- Oh, just shut your trap. Anyhow. We've never met before, have we? I'm Arata Sanada. Nice to meet you and all that. Hey now, that's no proper introduction. You must have put two and two together by now, but this is the person behind Blue Box. He's not what you imagined, is he? In the chat, he's kind and considerate, like a reliable big brother figure, right? When I first met him, I was really weirded out. He's surly, self-absorbed, and he's got this weird look in his eye. I mean, talk about a waste of good looks, am I right? Leave the stupidity for later, okay? So, while I was waiting for TK, I took a little look around. I thought that I thought that Mr. Navid fellow who called us here might be around. What? I thought you were looking for a ghost. Well, I was doing a little of that too. But in the end, I found neither. Rather, there wasn't anyone around to be found. You'd think there'd be one or two hackers in an area like Kowloon, no matter how dangerous it is. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Saren. I try I try to like mix my voice up a little bit between characters. <laughs> but for a mostly game that seems to be dominated by females, it's gonna be a little hard. Alright. Ah, so very sorry to keep you waiting. I'm Mr. Navit. I've got something for all you good boys and girls who showed up here today. This is the miraculous power to change the world. Huh? What? What is this? It's hacking. We've all been hacked. <laughs> oh, Digivice. A new program has been installed. Digimon Capture. Whoa, this Mr. Navid fellow is no slouch. He broke through my firewall like it was nothing. Digimon Capture? It's a hacking tool that's been making the rounds with hackers lately. Wait, so when you say Digimon, you mean like... Digimon? Digimon? Yes, those Digimon. The ones you're so interested in. Hmm. There's a certain kind of data known as digital monsters. Then... I'm assume that's that. There's a certain kind of data known as digital monsters that you can capture by scanning this thing, says. Ah, so Digimon is short for digital monster. What? Whoa, hey, hang on. Digimon are like nasty programs that hackers use, right? So then, so then, so then, that means, have we become hackers? Well, I suppose you could put it that way. Well, it's no big deal. Hackers are nothing out of the ordinary nowadays. No way, nah. -uh. Hackers are bad news. I am not doing this. I don't want any part of this. I'm going to delete this program. Uh, uh, what? No way. You've got to be kidding me. I can uninstall this thing? Leave it be. The program's protected. Who knows what'll happen if you force delete it. Yeah, uh, what do you mean? <laughs> I know! Digimon, Digital Mon- They probably don't even know that Digimon are the champions. Let <laughs> me get your head out from under those rocks. Huh? 
So that could be the ghost everyone's talking about. No, oh, could that? Don't let him get away. <laughs> it runs off screen. I, I can still see him though. He hasn't moved. I'm not ignorant to the background. Arata, hold off. Why are we chasing him? I'm, I'm out of here. I'm going home, you hear? You know what, a a or Nokia? Was, uh, Nokia was normally known as Akino, right? She doesn't seem much like, uh, the Akiho from, uh, Redigitized, so maybe this takes place sooner? Or that's not her at all? W what is this? It wasn't here before. What's it doing here? Did some hacker do this too? Is, is this telling us to keep going onward? Are they not letting us go back home? Huh. Arata could be in trouble. Let's go after him. Uh, no, I'm not going. I won't. <sighs> I don't know why my character is all of a sudden not verbal at all. Like, I understand, like, it gave me some choices. But, uh, she was... It seems like she was talking to herself a bunch earlier. Now, just as soon as people are around, it's only input. Alright, press the triangle button while in the field to activate the Digivice. You can save at almost any time from the save menu of your Digivice. It is not possible to save in some locations. Make sure you save frequently so you don't regret it if you do get a game over. Auto saving is not a thing. All right, let's check out this menu. Let's see, what we got Digimon is not available. Item, I probably have none. Player, let's see what kind of information we got here. All right, a bunch of a bunch of stuff I do not understand quite yet. Uh, all right, that's save. Let's set up these options. Is it the same options I had before? Yeah, it is. Okay. Well, I'm gonna save it because I do not want to regret it when I get a game over. Oh, it's got cross save too. So if I had this game on my Vita, I could uh, take it on the go. But I do not. I am not made of money. I'm not sure if this is this. Maybe this is a cross buy on, if you buy the digital copy. But I am not at all sure. All right, so I'm gonna head this way first. No, this isn't supposed to happen. Well, I'm sorry about your shit, Nokia. A firewall put up by a hacker. I don't know how to destroy it, but I need to go after Arata. Okay, let's do that. Oh, swing sets just. Subtly swing. That's creepy. This place is creepy. It's like, uh, it's giving me, uh, Toy Town feelings from previous games and media. Like this, this, uh, makes me feel like Monze Mono. We got some Toy Agumon references here. I think Toy Agumon also has a thing like that. It's just creepy looking. Does the Kowloon area stretch all the way back through here? It feels totally different from the cyberspace areas on the upper part of the Eden network. There's no trace of Arata. He may have gone further inside. Ugh. I should be careful. <laughs> I like that she just walked off of screen instead of just completely fading out. Still no uh, turning left and right. I cannot zoom out as far as I could before. I guess the minimap's fine. It would be it would be completely forgiving, not giving me full camera control if it put items on the map as well. But uh, we don't know that quite yet. We'll see. Was that him? I couldn't tell. Oh, see, I have a uh, I have black uh, outlines now. That must be a white boy. Perhaps. Oh no, did I die? Is this like the amazing horror movie Stay Alive, where if you die in the game, you die in real life? Featuring the guy who played Malcolm from Malcolm in the Middle. Alright, a bunch of... that is... wow. 
I'm pretty sure that's actually uh, Digimon Runes, which I, I, you know what, that's the thing I have not talked about in any Digimon videos, but there is actually a uh, language set of Digimon Runes, which all do translate to letters and stuff, that I think that might be them right there. That's a, a smaller known piece of information because it's almost never used in media, but I believe that uh, like certain, like you'll see the runes and it'll just be like, oh, is that just, that's just there to look pretty, but I think uh, there actually is like a meaning behind that stuff. It appears in uh, Digimon stuff, but it's never really uh, built upon. What was that? Kaloon's as dangerous as they say. Who knows what might happen here? I better hurry up, find Arata, and get out of here. Is that you, white boy? <laughs> white boy? I like that name. It's, it sounds fun. What's wrong? You look like you've seen a ghost. Ugh. You saw a ghost that looked like me. Now this guy, <laughs> I did a hand gesture and pointed. Ghastly boy, he kind of reminds me of uh, there was a kid in Redigitize. I forget his name, but he had black hair. He pretty much looked like that guy, but in darker clothing. I'm getting vibes that that's him. Maybe he's a repeat character. <gasps> oh, pardon me. Pardon me being as gassy as possible. Oh, if that's true, that ghost might have been me. Some call me the Wraith of Eden. They say I'm not of this world. Huh? The truth is simply that I'm rather elusive and tend to turn up unexpectedly. That's all. Please relax, I'm not a ghost. I'm very real here in Eden. I exist to guide, to guide those who are lost, like you. So I suppose if you're if you're on YouTube or Twitch and I'm not responding... Actually no, the Saren is on Twitch, I'm seeing his message. If you're on YouTube and I'm not responding, I apologize. Restream chat is a little stupid. <clears throat> You've just had a program installed, installed Digimon Capture, which marks you as a hacker. But you are still merely a fledgling hacker. Hmm? There are hackers with a wide variety of different goals here in Eden. Chivalrous ones who find and report security holes. Thieves who steal accounts to rob money and data. Others are just out to prove their skills. Truly a wide variety. What kind of hacker do you want to be? Hmm. Uh, you are indeed a fledgling if that is your only response, not even hatched from your egg yet. You're free to become a hacker if you want, or something else altogether. It's up to you. What led you to this? What led you to this is neither here nor there. You came here because you were interested in hacking, and now, because of that, you've got the Digimon Capture program, yes? I would therefore recommend you give the remarkable powers of these Digimon programs a try. Mm. Hmm. That's fine. Now, to commemorate your birth as a fellow hacker, to be, I shall present you with your first Digimon. There, behind you. That is the Digimon program. Hmm? Who is it? Is it gonna be an Agumon? It's- oh, it's Terriermon! Oh, and there's a Palmon? Hagurumon? There are three different types of Digimon here, but you can take only one. Which will you choose? Hmm. <laughs> Alright, it's not giving me names because I, I guess my character doesn't know who they are. I'm leaning towards Terriermon real hard. Cause, uh, I like Terriermon. Uh, Palmon's fun. You know, yeah, I'm going with the excessively adorable animal type. Terriermon. That Digimon. Do you want Terriermon? I want Terriermon. You seem to have made up your mind. Okay, let's bring you out of your shell. Several steps are required to obtain a Digimon. If you discover or encounter a Digimon program, run a scan, and then acquire the analyzed data. Oh, I oh, worded that a little weirdly. Those are all done with Digimon Capture. You can use that without any restrictions. 
But just because you got the analyzed data doesn't mean the Digimon program itself is yours. First, you must convert it. You must launch the Digimon program and implement it in cyberspace first and foremost. Only then can it serve as a digital monster, a hacking program that is not to be trifled with. Unlike Scan, however, Convert is not part of the Digimon Capture application. We hackers finally devised the technique needed, but certain rules were put in place regarding how it's used, in order to control how the power is exercised. Your chosen Digimon program is still weak, but it will grow in power and Digivolve. As you gain experience as a hacker, your programs will become more powerful as well. Someday, immense power might be yours. When that day comes, responsibility will come along with it. Hackers may be free spirits, but they must never su succumb to chaos. Never that. I'm sure most of this went over your head, but tuck it away in a corner of your mind. Besides, merely having Digimon capture gives you hacker status. It's a special program, but... A hacker's abilities, values, and goals can all be seen in how well that hacker can use the Digimon programs. Because protecting the Order of Eden is a hacker's first duty. I would be, I would be very happy if you would try to become that kind of hacker. Mm. After all, hackers have been with Eden since its inception. Ugh. Something, something. You want the Digimon right now? Yeah. I see. You heard what I had to say and decided you wanted to become a proud hacker too. Excellent. Ugh. I wish my character had more dialogue when people were around. <laughs> well then, follow the steps. Start with a scan, have Digimon capture running, and target a... Huh? Oh, I said something. Even though that pretty much was a sound. Oh wow, is that a, cr a Crystallimon? Crystallismon? I've always been a little confused about the name of that one. That's the form that uh, Karamon skipped in uh, the Digimon movie. And they were like, oh my god, how can he beat us? Oh, he must have skipped champion level. That's the champion level right there. The Digimon I prepared for you went and ran away. There are plenty of other Digimon. We'll find another. Wait just a moment. That did surprise me though. For a Digimon as tough as that one to appear in this area? could have been released as a bad joke by a low-level hacker, or as an attack on me by someone. What do you mean? What's that? You want to go after it? You want a powerful Digimon like that? I guess I couldn't predict what she was saying. No, you couldn't handle it. Forget about it. Something. What's that? You're concerned about the Digimon being chased? Yeah. You are a curious one. Still, that's all the more reason to leave it be. You'd look foolish if you got hurt interfering in a fight between two mere programs. I have to go help. If that's what you want, then you should do it. Chase after it, if that's your decision. Mm-hmm. I will do that, white boy. It seems there's a thing over here, though. HP capsule C times three. All right, so yes, it it seems that items are on the mini map, so it's completely forgivable that you do not give me camera control. So me in and out does not change the mini map either. Fuck, you're fucking with my terrier, mon boy. Oh, that's cool. It's got a little thing on the screen and a little animation. Hmm. Oh boy, you really are new at this. Do you intend to face off against a digital monster unarmed? I don't know who Familiar Voice is, so I don't know how to how to tone that. Is it Blue Box? Oh no, it's White Boy again. <laughs> you truly are curious. No, you're just a soft touch. That's it. What a coincidence. I am both those things as well. Just this once, allow me to aid you. You, um, needn't do anything for the moment. Watch and learn. This is how a real hacker uses their skills. Oh, Machine Dramon, that looks cool. Alright, so tapping it is screening up button. Well, it seems it wants to fight with you. 
It may have been something of an ordeal, but that Digimon is now yours. Instruct it well and master the program. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's cute. Alright, 15% scan. 